Game of Thrones, summed up. Episode 1, Winter is Coming. The episode starts off with three men going through a wall, onto the snowy side, on horseback. One guy splits up from them, that one guy finds some dead bodies, and runs off to tell the others who think it's the wildlings. So we go back, and then there's nothing there. And then the two get killed, so the other guy then legs it, but spots one of the other guys, who then gets killed. Then the long intro starts, showing up a map of Westeros. We then cut to some horsemen chasing down the last survivor on a green hill. And we go to Winterfell where we meet the Stark brothers doing archery while the ladies do sewing. Ned Stark gets told about the deserter, so he goes after him with Bran, his son. Catelyn gives Jon Snow a funny look. Ned Stark then beheads the deserter, and him and Bran mention the White Walkers. On the way back, they stop at a dead deer, and then they find a dead direwolf and steal the puppies, giving one to every Stark child, including John. We then go to King's Landing where an old man has died, the King's Hand. We then meet Cersei and her brother Jaime, and they discuss a secret among them. A raven then arrives at Winterfell, where Catelyn delivers a message to Ned that the King's Hand is dead, and that the King is heading for them. So they get ready for him and his company. Bran watches the King arrive from the top of the castle, then gets told off by his mother, but he tells about the King arriving. The King and all his men enter into Winterfell, and meets the whole Stark family, and the King and Ned were, slash our friends. Ned and the King go into a crypt, and visit Ned's sister's grave. The King also asks Ned to be the King's hand. We then meet Tyrion sleeping and drinking with a whore, but Jaime walks in on them, and in enters more women. The king pays his respect to Ned's sister and mentions the Tigarians. We then cut to the last two alive, who are both siblings. The brother leaves and the sister has a bath in steam and hot water. They then meet the Dethraki and the leader, Carl Drogo, aka Horseman. And he's going to marry the sister, but he runs off after seeing her. They also plan to go over the sea to Westeros to get the throne back, but they need an army from the Carl, and the brother will stop at nothing to get it. Back at Winterfell, Sansa wants to marry King Joffrey. The feast then starts, but Jon Snow is outside training, when he meets his uncle Benji, and talks about joining the Wall, slash the Night's Watch. Jon then meets Tyrion, and talk about being bastards and midgets. Benji meets Ned, and they talk about the deserter, and what he said to see. Catelyn and Ned have some bed talk about being the King's Hand, and she gets told Jon Arryn, her sister's husband, was killed by the Lannisters. And Ned makes his decision. Back to the Dothraki, who are also having a party of sorts for the wedding. We also meet Jora Marmont, who gives Danny, the sister one, some books. She also gets three dragon eggs, then put on a horse and rides off with a carl. And then the two have sex on the beach. Ned and the others then head out with the king, while Bran climbs over a tower and spots Jamie having sex with his sister. Jamie then pushes Bran out of the tower. End of episode.